Patron Evan Collins says, have you felt conflicted in any creative decisions taken in the show on how to tell a part of the story? I think I wouldn't, I wouldn't say conflicted. I would say that there were certain things that I thought were not as clear to me. And as a result, I thought maybe there would be ways to kind of play it so that it would be clearer to me because if, if it wasn't clear to me, then maybe it might not be clear to other people. So mm -hmm. I wanted to always make sure and I want to always make sure that I'm trying to uh, represent both sides of Christ, his divinity and his humanity as balanced as I can, as balanced as the writing will allow me in a way that uh, it seems authentic, whatever the spirit channels through me that people are getting from from watching this and, and, and receiving. I want to make sure to continue to, you know, discern and pray over it. And if there's if there are any kinds of things where I'm not clear, um, it's, it's simply a matter of asking my friend and creator of the show, hey, what do you think about if I play this like this? And more often than not, he'll be like, yeah, that's cool. Or let's try it. Or like, you know what, that doesn't work because this, this, this and this. And and I'll realize like, oh, there's these other things that he wants to have happen that I wasn't aware of. I wasn't thinking about because when you're approaching a role, you're, you're not thinking of everybody else's role. You're not always always thinking about the bigger picture as to what the overarching story is. And he knows what the story is from beginning to end. We don't. We get season by season, episode by episode. Um, but he knows what the bigger picture is. So I have to always defer to him and trust him. And, and, um, and I think it's worked out really well. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you. Uh, patron uh, Rhiannon says, which episodes or scenes did you find the easiest and or the most difficult to portray? And did this surprise you? Easiest and difficult. Um, well, on some level, um, they're all difficult because I think just trying to wrap your head around what it could be like to portray um, this, you know, sinless son of God on earth. Uh, <laughs> it's a bit of a conundrum that uh, from time to time will often trip me up. Um, and then I just got to sort of shake it off and go pray and everything will be cool again. Um, I'd say probably the most fun and, and the easiest would be uh, episode three with the children um, to a point, you know, anytime I was interacting with them, it was just fun and breezy. And then it gets a little heavier later on in, in one in that part of the episode. Um, so then like any scene that there's there are challenges and, and uh, um, that wasn't without them. Uh, but I'd say that was probably the, the lightest of all of the uh, episodes that I've filmed so far. Uh, most difficult, I think. Again, I think the difficulty is is the same as far as uh, technical aspects of the acting, um, spiritually, theologically, trying to make sure I communicated what I received from John three sixteen with the Nicodemus scene on the roof mm -hmm. um, was something that to me was like, okay, this is. This is a scene that I, I, I want to get it right. And, and um, you know, um, I'm reminded uh, Dallas is like, I think a couple of times, you know, he, he'll remind me. It's like, God's not going to let you screw this up. You know, God's not going to let me screw this up, referring to himself as well. You know, mm. we're here. We're, we just, we just got to show up with open hearts and, um, and just to commit ourselves to excellence in the way that we ha have tried to do. And the spirit will do the rest. But still, as a human, as an actor trying yeah. to do a scene, you're like, uh, you know, I, I want to make sure that at the very least in, in every scene that I'm exuding or trying to um, have as much compassion and tenderness and mercy as Jesus could have had in, in my very limited capacity to 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 do that with whoever my scene partner is. So if you and I are doing a scene I'm going to, Jonathan's going to look at Matt and just try to love on Matt mm -hmm. to the best of my ability and, and see everything about you that is presented in your spirit and just try to just embrace that. And, um, and that's, that's kind of what my, my challenge is, um, as I'm playing him. So it, it forces you to be a better human, you know, you're just trying to be a better person, 
mm. constantly. That's awesome. Thank you for watching this clip. You can click here to watch the full episode. And I want to say a big thanks to our sponsors and to our amazing patrons for making all of this possible. Please do us a favor before you go, click that subscribe button and then the bell. And that way YouTube will be forced to let you know every time we put out a new episode.